Welcome back. In this video, I will discuss how to encode and decode the word DAD using arithmetic coding. The problem definition is like a source emits four symbols A, B, C, D with the probabilities 0 0.4, 0 0.2, 0 0.1 and 0 0.3 respectively. So here we need to construct arithmetic coding to decode and encode the word DAD. The symbol probabilities and their corresponding subranges are shown below. These are the symbols and associated probabilities are given. So here we need to find the subrange for each symbols. The subrange for A is 0 to 0.4 and for B is 0 0.4 to 0 0.4 plus 0.2 that is 0.6 and for C is 0.6. 2.6 plus 0.1 that is 0.7 and for D 0.7 2.7 plus 0.3 that is 1. So once you find the subrange for E symbol next we need to encode a word DAD. To encode the word uh, initially we will assume the range between 0 to 1 that is what shown here. In the DAD, the first symbol is D, so we need to transmit the symbol D. Uh, the D will lies between the interval 0 0.7 and 1, that is what shown here. Again, we need to find the subrange for E symbols in between the interval 0 0.7 and 1. To find the subrange, we use the following formula, that is low is equal to low plus range into low range high is equal to low plus range into high range. Here low is a, uh, the lowest value in the interval that is 0 0.7 and range is 1 minus 0 0.7 that is equal to 0 0.3 and a low range and high range will be discussed later. First we will find the low and high for the symbol A. So for symbol A uh, low which is equal to uh, low that is 0 0.7 plus range is 0 0.3 into uh, the lowest range of the symbol A that is 0. So, which is 0. So, once you calculate this one, we will get low is equal to 0 0.7 and high is equal to 0 0.7 plus 0 0.3 into highest uh, range of the symbol A that is 0.4. So, once you calculate this one, we will get high is equal to 0.82. That is what shown here. So, next we need to find the subrange for the symbol B. For the symbol B low which is equal to 0 0.7 plus 0 0.3 into uh, the lowest range of the symbol B is 0 0.4. So, we will get the low which is equal to 0 0.82 and high uh, which is equal to 0 0.88. Similarly, we will find the subrange for the symbol uh, C and D. Once the symbol D is transmitted, the new range is as shown below. This will be looked like this. So, next symbol to be transmitted is A. For the symbol A, the new ranges are between 0 0.7 to 0 0.82. So, again we need to find the subrange for E symbol in between the interval 0 0.7 and 0 0.2. We use the same formula that is low is equal to low plus range into low range divided by high is equal to low plus range into high range. Here low is the lowest value in the interval that is 0 0.7 and the range is uh, 0 0.82 minus 0 0.7 which is equal to 0 0.12 and for the A uh, low which is equal to 0 0.7 plus 0 0.2 into 0. 0 is nothing but the lowest range for the symbol A which is equal to 0 0.7 and high is equal to 0 0.7 plus 0 0.12 into 0 0.4 that is the highest range for the symbol A that is 0.4. So, we will get high is equal to 0 0.748 and for the B low is equal to 0.748 and high is equal to 0 0.772. Similarly, we will find the subrange for the symbol C and D. Once the symbol A is transmitted, the new range is as shown below. The next symbol to be transmitted is D. Uh, but in the DAD word, the last symbol is D. So, that the interval for the symbol D is 0 0.7842.82. 
once you encode all the symbols of the word dad next we need to calculate the tag value uh, tag value is nothing but the average of lower and upper interval so uh, tag which is equal to lower plus upper divided by 2 that is 0 0.784 plus 0 0.82 divided by 2 which is equal to 0 0.802. The tag is transmitted from source to destination. Once tag is received at a destination side, next we need to decode a word DAD. The tag received by the receiver is 0.802. Initially, we assumed the interval between the 0 to 1. Here, we will compare the tag value with the symbol subrange value. Uh, here, we can find that 0 0.802 lies between the 0 0.791. and 1, So, that uh, corresponding decoded symbol is D. 0.802 is lies between 0 0.7 to 1 so that the new interval is fixed as 0 0.7 to 1. So, here again we, we need to compute the new tag value. To compute the new tag value, we use the following formula that is new tag which is equal to tag minus low divided by range. So, tag is uh, initial tag that is 0 0.802 minus low that is the lowest range of the uh, symbol D that is 0 0.7 divided by range. Range is 1 minus 0 0.7 which is equal to 0 0.3. So, we will get a new tag as 0 0.34. This 0 0.34 lies between the range 0 to 0 0.4. So, that decoded symbol is A. Here 0 0.34 is lies between 0 to 0 0.4 hence the new interval fixed as 0 to 0.4. Again we need to find the new tag value by using this formula. So that uh, tag which is equal to that is new tag which is equal to tag minus low divided by range which is equal to tag is 0 0.34 minus uh, lowest range of symbol A is 0 divided by range that is 0 0.4 minus 0 which is equal to 0 0.4 so that a new tag value is 0 0.85. So, 0 0.85 lies between the range 0 0.7 to 1 uh, hence the decoded symbol is D. Hence, the decoded word is DAD. This is how we can encode and decode a word DAD using arithmetic coding. I hope the concept of arithmetic coding is clear. If you like the video, do like and share with your friends. Press the subscribe button for more videos. Press the bell icon for regular updates. Thank you for watching.